Okay, Pisa Bunkai and Pinan Shodan, the Marotiuk, key eye point there. Okay, I have my own name for this, it's a sort of blast and smash type application. Quick basic, simple to do, uh, Boris Stewart here. Either a single grab or a double grab. Uh, it's safer, I'll do it from a single at the moment. And I'm not hanging around here. As soon as that goes on, I feel that pull in for that strike. I'm going to blast straight in. And I'm blasting straight in the forearm strike there and forearm strike there. Or, more detailed, single knuckle strike to the end of the ear. Or a nice one, jam the elbow straight in that way. I've got that multiple options just in that single move. That, that forearm, that elbow. Okay? As soon as that goes on, boom, in, pop the head, five in. Okay, and it's going to work equally well from a double lapel grab. He's pulling in maybe for the height, but boom, jam that in, right? A wee back up here. Let's say I'm just slightly late with this. I saw the cover to this on my other clip on the Jordan Hook of Pinan Nidan, where I had Stuart up along the wall, and I do a switch of grips here, crank the neck and take him down. So this could work at the wall as well. But I'll just do it here. There's the blast in. There's that. Maybe you haven't quite achieved much here. Uh, I'm going to try and switch grips here to wind the elbow through, take the posture a bit. It depends on that going at the same time. So, grab the jawline, shoulder, crank them around, and take them down. Okay. So that throw bit is on that G down the right there. There's the part there where I switch and strike. There's the throw. Okay, so again. Strike, strike. Switch. Right. Right. Once more, let's speak. That concludes my blast and smash interpretation of Marathi Yuk and Pinan Shodan.